Hello, trainer, and welcome to the world of Pokemon. <laughs> My name is Professor Sequoia Tree, and I will be your guide huh? throughout this what? adventure. Huh? Whoa. Go back, go back, go back. What's your name? Where, where'd you lose me? At Hello Trainer or like? Someone really liked 11th grade bio. No, man, they're all named what, after what, trees. What's your, what's your name? <laughs> His name is Sequoia, Sequoia Tree, not <laughs> Oak. No, don't Oak. question it. Okay. Nice. It's Oak. It's hey. Sequoia Tree. <laughs> I'm a professor. It's not Oak Tree. It's just Oak. Oh. No, 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 no. It's not just Sequoia. Tree. It's Sequoia Tree. I'm not going to stand for this. I have a higher education than all of you. I'm a professor. Okay. Nobody uh -huh. question my name. It's part of the. It's part of the doctorate. Anyways, okay. I will be your guide. I got high during my education, too. Oh, my God. <laughs> uh, so, Chili, as the oh only trainer in this town, I have three Pokemon for you, since uh, nobody else wanted them. It's a Squirrel, a Charmander, and a Bulbasaur. Uh, Easy. My first question for you is, what would you like to name them? And you can name them. Name them? Whoa, I get all three of them? There's no other kids in the town, and the ones I sent out never came back, so Chili just gets all of them. <laughs> <laughs> she, glitched. she glitched the game. Uh, Charmander will be... So 2021 started up and uh, it's already a bad year. Uh, but the only thing I can distract myself from the world around me is some good audiobooks. Oh God, please help. While I'm trying to avoid bad thoughts, things like Audible really bring up the mood and uh, we'd like to thank them for sponsoring this video. I, I love using Audible like when I'm just relaxing. Like currently, I've been listening to this book, You Can't Hurt Me by David Goggins. It's a really easy listen. Uh, I just throw it on in the background. It's, it's about this guy. He has it's such an interesting life. It's so calming. It's so assuring. And 2021 is <laughs> crazy, but this calms me down. Everybody go take this. Give this one a listen. If you join Audible today, you'll get one credit to use for any title, as well as unlimited access to Audible Originals and the book you choose, you get to keep it forever. Wow. And if you don't like it, you can exchange wow. it. No questions asked. Why? And you'll Why? get access to the all-new Plus catalog, which includes podcasts, guided fitness, meditation programs, and more. And you can download titles and listen offline anytime, anywhere, and on all smartphones and tablets. You can start your 30-day free trial today and get your free book by going to audible.com slash recreo or text recreo to 500-500. And thank you, Audible, again for sponsoring this video. Girl. Woo! Uh, now back to the regular video. Uh, Charmander will be Blaine. I feel like that's fit. Char Char, Char, uh, Charmander. Squirtle. Squirtle will be duh. It's not that hard, Chili. Just just pick somebody. <laughs> God. <laughs> Squirtle will be dead. Okay. Squirtle. And then your last one, you have a Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur will be Christian. What up? I just like to think that Christian's bulb is like just a pot leaf. And, and <laughs> so now that you're fully equipped for this journey ahead, I have a favor to ask. There were actually two more Pokemon in my lab that somehow escaped. I'm going to need you uh -huh. to take these Pokeballs and catch them back for me. Okay. Chili wanders into the tall grass <laughs> to find a Pikachu and an Eevee sitting under a tree. Oh, the Weirdly best enough, two. they are capable of human speech. What's up with this child labor? That you're having There's no other kids in this town. <laughs> so you're going to have a kid do this regardless. Yes. Okay. That's how every Pokemon game works. So okay. who do you want to send into battle to take down these two wild Pokemon? Blaine, let's go Charmander. Char, 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 Charmander. Can I talk or do I just have to keep this? I <laughs> <laughs> How immersive do you want this Char to be? I want, I want him to say that. I want it animated just like that. Char. This is the easiest <laughs> roll you were you will ever land. This is the easiest roll. <laughs> All right, so you send out you send out Blaine. You have to send out another one because there's two here, so it's a two v two. Okay, I send out Charmander and Bulbasaur. Wait, I'm eating. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Squirtle and Charmander. Squirtle, Squirtle and Charmander. Uh, Charmander, flamethrower. <laughs> Whoa, that's a high level Charmander. I am a very highly skilled trainer. Right? That is not how that works. What, uh, what do you want your Bulbasaur to do? He's eating. I'm eating, motherfucker. This is the worst. Relax. We said Squirtle. Squirtle will do tackle. 
Go attack! Squirtle, Squirtle, I use my red ball. I spit it at uh, the Pikachu. <laughs> your what? And your attacks are successful. Why did Professor Whatever Tree give you the most <laughs> defunctional... <laughs> Pokemon. Uh, Charmander sees a, a gender reveal in the distance and he, he starts no! getting ideas. It's a ball! <laughs> so the battle goes on for at least 10 minutes before the Pikachu <laughs> is knocked out immediately from each successful attack. The Eevee is caught in the crossfire, taking equal damage from the blow. Now is your chance to catch them. So you need to I roll. I throw Get my em. Pokeball at the Eevee. You gotta catch both of them. I throw two Pokeballs. Oh my god. <laughs> You're, the worst right. <laughs> You're the only kid this town has to offer. Okay, so you have to roll a Literally three or higher. The only kid. Anyways, the catch is successful, so you now have two more Pokemon to your party. What would you Yay. like to name them? Kurt will be Eevee, Chris will be Pikachu. So after successfully adding two more Pokemon to your party, you notice a suspicious character with a large R on their shirt attempting to steal a young girl's diglet. Uh, do I want to help her? Yeah, yes or no? Sure, sure. Why? Okay. You want to help her steal? No, no, no you're gonna we're help helping her, her from not being stolen from. not getting from. robbed. Christian, oh my God. Oh. Why are you helping the kid? <laughs> I have a pot leaf on my back. Morals! How does one steal a diglet? Isn't it like stuck to the ground? But imagine someone steals like a plant. All the Pokemon you could have chosen from, why did you choose wait, wait, a diglet? What's underneath a diglet? What is it? Like, we're never gonna find out. You know what I don't know. It's just Ivan yeah. underground. It's a full muscular human body. <laughs> just, a, just, a, just a ball sack. <laughs> All the, all the things you could have went to, Chris. It's like feet, <laughs> legs, a full body, a torso. Nah, dude, it's Ball just a hanging sack. scrotum. If you, if you look at it for long enough, it is safe to assume. <laughs> that is what it would seem. Chili confronts the shady man. He states he's a member of the elusive Pokemon terrorist group, Team Rocket. He throws out a large purple snake with an intimidating presence. So he's challenging you to a battle. Who do you want to send out? Put me in there, put me in there. I put throw Bulbasaur. I literally right. grab him and throw him. Throw me and I will throw hands. Let's go. All right, Bulbasaur, what are you trying to do? What's your attack? I turn around at my mm. owner and go, what do you want me to do? Oh, can I use all of my Pokemon to fight this? <laughs> no, this isn't a gang war. You can't just no, tell this is a one-on-one. -on -one. Let's just pretend this purple snake looks like Barney. Oh, then, Christian, that's all on you. That's between you and him. Okay. Okay, let me think. I use passive-aggressive mind games, and I oh make him insecure, and then he falls back to his owner's Pokeball in shame. <laughs> Why are your attacks emotional manipulation? It's super effective. <laughs> All right, well, let's, sit, let's see. So you have to roll a three or higher for your to be super effective. Oh, my so, God. Unfortunately, Arbok <laughs> lunges at Christian, latching its fangs it deep inside. Arbok? Yeah, that's what it, it was. Evolved? Yeah, wasn't that supposed to be an Ekid? All we heard you say was the guy whipped out his purple snake, and I just let my imagination <laughs> run wild. <laughs> Sorry, the purple snake latches its fangs deep inside of Christian's body. Your Pokemon so I, now, I, I like it. Blade said that, I look at this like completely <laughs> differently. Yeah, bro. <laughs> this is too graphic. This is too graphic. Hold on. Christian becomes poisoned and faints. You have to send out another Pokemon and try again. Uh, who did it go out? Okay, let's do a Kurt. Actually, no, normal. Tight no, 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 no. no. Chili, please. Chris, Pikachu, let's go, Pikachu. I'm gonna let you down, coach. <laughs> Why does this Pikachu sound like it's going through its third divorce? <laughs> what the? No one, I never got to evolve, okay? I've been Pikachu for a very long time. Yo, he's talking with like a five o'clock shadow and like a cigarette. In his mouth. A Pikachu has a mortgage, bro. <laughs> <laughs> what right. move do you want to use? You're the trainer. I'm, I suck at coming up with names. Let them come up with their own moves. Otherwise, I'm gonna say the boring normal ones. Oh, I got this. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, Everybody can come up with their own moves. Pikachu puts down the flask. He's like, all right, I got uh, this. All right, hold up, hold up, uh, tail whip. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, uh, all right, let's see. Uh, tail whip work? So the move is successful. Ah, uh, see? 
He was so drunk that his tail whip became like the iron tail move. Oh, just God. slapped him with a flaccid tail over and over. Again, <laughs> which, yeah. Don't say no, flaccid why? tail. Don't we're, say we're that. We're stacking feet in this episode, guys. As opposed to an erect tail? Tail tail whip doesn't even do damage. <laughs> it just lowers defense. Yeah, you weren't expecting that, were you, bitch? What, <laughs> what I hate about it is it's the purple snake imagery from Blaine, and then it's just Chris backing up into him with his tail. So it just, I'm so sorry. Oh, no. I now tell Pikachu to use Thunder Shock. <laughs> Please. So Arbok becomes incapacitated, and the Team Rock Rocket member escapes into a nearby cave. You and your Pokemon chase after him. As you enter the cave, Chili, you are blindsided by a second member of Team Rocket who manages to steal- Wait, Chili just gets rocked? She just punched by a full grown man. She's like eight. Who jumps at eight year old? I'm only eight. <laughs> so Chili is knocked out and blindsided and her three of her Pokemon are stolen, leaving her only with the Pikachu and the Eevee. In a state of desperation, Team Rocket member sends out all three against you. Wow. All three of them? Yeah, so it's two versus oh, this three. This isn't gonna go good. But Bulbasaur is dead. It's just, it's just there. It's still <laughs> out, okay? It's just not doing much. So I'm out, fucking passed out on the ground. Charmander uses pulse check on the Bulbasaur. <laughs> Guys, it's not very effective. I grabbed the Bulbasaur. Good job, I got one back. Chewie walks across the battlefield and grabs. <laughs> I have, I got back my Bulbasaur. And, <laughs> and then walks back. Eevee, evolve. I throw a thunderstone at Eevee. Did you just have one? Yeah, where'd you get this thunderstone? Where did you get that? I don't like you forcing I, evolutions. I like how Pikachu is like a drunk alcoholic and then Chili chooses to throw it at Eevee instead. I've been waiting for so well, normal, long to evolve. Normal is useless. I shoved the thunderstone down Eevee's throat. Oh my God. Oh! You consent. I don't like where this is going at all. It accidentally evolves. Oh my God. Wow, now I have a Jolteon and Pikachu. Thanks, Chili. Now I sound like this. Is that what happens when they evolve? I turn to scroll and like her team comp is all messed up. She's got two electric types. What is she? I thinking? forgot how you evolved to Umbreon and Espeon, so we're just going with you it. You really fucked this okay. up for everyone. Pikachu Thunder Shock on Squirtle. You Easy. Chili <laughs> <laughs> evolves Kurt, but then ignores Kurt and uses Chris anyway. <laughs> What was you the guys, point? What, what was guys, the point? You made me feel bad. I didn't use it on him, so now he gets his redemption arc. Pikachu, thunder shock on Squirtle. Uh, all right. <laughs> 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 they don't come out as easy as they used to. I don't like midlife crisis Pikachu, man. This shit's messing me up. So am I just dead? Yeah. This whole episode, I'm just gonna be dead? You e So you evolve fucking Kurt for no reason, but you don't bother giving me some spray? <laughs> so I'm just gonna be dead this whole time. If it helps, I'm dead inside. <laughs> I chuck a revive at the complaining Bulbasaur. I throw it back. I'd rather be dead than be your fucking pet, you piece of shit. Stay dead then, stay dead. Fuck you. Stay dead. Fuck you. You. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. So let's see if your your attacks oh. were successful. Um, so you have to roll a four or higher. Wait, I used an evasive maneuver. I used uh, right in dirty. They saw me rolling. Nobody attacked you. <laughs> oh my God. Sorry, Blaine, that move is outdated and it's not effective. I am Charmillionaire. <laughs> and nobody attacked you. He's right in dirty. <laughs> God. He evolved, he evolved himself. So you roll a six. The battle is successful. The opposing Pokemon fall unconscious and are returned to their Pokeballs. The Team Rocket drops the stolen Pokeballs and flees. As the Team Rocket member attempts to escape, they are abruptly thrust into the water by an unseen force. Suddenly, a large silhouette begins to rise from the water. <laughs> Whoa, we're already oh facing a legendary? <laughs> yeah. An ethereal voice echoes from him. Mewtwo. Already? Wait, it's our first day out here. I don't 
even have a system yet. <laughs> yeah. A Mewtwo is challenging you to a battle. Who Ooh, do you want to send out? Holy. I forgot. There's. So, I left something out in the back. Okay, I gotta. I gotta get out of here. Pikachu, let's go. Oh, if you win, listen. If you win, I will give you another thunderstorm. Where are you oh my these god. From? We just had those. All right, all right. Mewtwo, Mewtwo, come here. Come here. <laughs> I tell you something. And I bring him in, I headbutt him. <laughs> go! Go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Char, Char, he's go, begging go, for death. Go, Char! Go! Go! World Star! All right, so you have to roll a five or higher, so let's see if your what? attack is effective. That's, oh, my God. Uh, oh, shit. No, it's uh, rigged. Good? Rigged! <laughs> Rigged. Oh shit! Chris is suddenly <laughs> lifted to, into the air as a large purple ball of energy strikes him from behind. The impact of the attack knocks him out completely. Send out another Pokemon. I have one. Chili, throw me. Who's left? Chili, throw me out. Zeon, no. let's go, Kurt. They're all no, dead pull me back up. Kurt. <laughs> oh, maybe you should try throwing another Kurt. I really think. Get me in there. Kurt, get in there. No. Kurt, get in there. <laughs> what oh the my fuck? God. That's one form Jolteon. I send out my Jolteon. I use empathy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit, Mewtwo's a sociopath. It's not effective. Oh, what else? I make him use Thunderbolt. Oh my god, Kurt's Thunderbolt lands a critical hit on Mewtwo. Mewtwo loses its footing and collapses onto the ground. Wow. It seems unable to continue the battle. The legendary wow. Mewtwo got defeated Wait. by a level one Jolteon. He lost his he lost his footing and died. You one shot of Mewtwo? Yeah, he just collapsed to the ground. He's not dead, but he's just chilling. Char char, that guy's yeah. Fucked. He's dead. Char, char, char. All right, so uh, you exit the cave as the authorities storm the inside, finding miscellaneous drugs, captured Pokemon, and stolen goods. And oh there we go. God. That's it. That's your first Pokemon journey. Or last. <laughs> All right, Trainer Chili, can we get an outro? Can I get a big thank you for my Pikachu and my Charmander? Who yeah. are you guys? Uh, I'm... Char, char Char? Can I break? Or, <laughs> uh, hey, again, I'm Blaine Gibson. We, we, were, we were on this once before. Yeah. I'm yeah. Chris Damaris. Yeah. Uh, we're from Rooster Teeth. We're also on the Woo. podcast uh, Good Morning from Hell, where we interview everyone in hell. Uh, I'm dead, yeah. and Blaine is uh, Satan's little brother. And uh, this is our little cross promotion where we had uh, Kurt yeah, and Ivan. Yeah. On recently on our yeah. show as uh, yeah. David and Goliath, we had a rematch yeah. down in hell, and <laughs> yeah. then uh, uh, and then we had Christian and Din on as uh, uh, um, Adam and Eve Adam recently. Eve. So yeah, 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 yeah. Now we have one more to get before we've caught Me. them all. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's a good Josh send off. Soul, oh shit. Soul, <laughs> I'm the best it's Pokemon chilly. trainer. Recreo out. Hello, fellow trainers. As always, thank you so much for watching the video. Before we go, just want to give a quick shout out to all our patrons Ado Chan, Essie Pink Dog, James the Sheriff Dixon, Augustine, Austin Eisenring, Austin Towner, Barnesinator, Emmy Otabu, Fawn Ears, Flippy, Hero Sticks, Kane Games, Leo Tempest, Michael Brown, Mifo, Stitchu, Yoshia Pines, Hawk Frosty, and the Astonishing Gemini. You guys are great, and I can't wait to catch them all with you soon. Goodbye.